Today, I will show the different parts of a flower. Because a flowering plant produces its offspring through the sexual reproduction, so a flower is an important, I mean reproductive organ of a plant. And to understand the process of fertilization, we must have to know about the different parts of a flower. Let us see. Receptacle Receptacle or thalamus it is a part of a flower stalk to which the floral exists of a flower are attached. Sepal Sepals is the outermost hole of a flower. It may be joined or segmented and sepals protect the flower during budding stage and sepals usually green leaf-like and Sepals are collectively known as calyx. Some flowers have epicalyx below the calyx, like china rose. Petal Petal is the second hole of a flower. They brightly colored to attract the insect for pollination. Then, anther and filament. Anther and filament are main reproductive organ known as stamen. Anther contain pollen sacs, I mean pollen grains. Then stigma, style, and ovary. These three are the female reproductive organ known as the carpel. And here you can see the ovary I have shown here in separately. Like see, this is an ovary, and inside the ovary there are a view. And inside the ovule, there is an embryonic sac. And inside the embryonic sac, there is an egg that will be fertilized in fertilization. So, again I am saying the different parts of a flower. First one, receptacle, then sepal, then petal, anther, filament. And anther and filament are the main reproductive organ known as the stamen and stigma, style and ovary are the female reproductive organ of a flower known as the carpel. And this carpel and the stamen are the essential hold of a flower. So, thank you.